What's up guys, Jeff Cavalier here at uh, Jesse at jessejameswest.com. Perfect, next scene, benching. So today we're gonna be going over how to bench press properly. Hey, guys, can we, get the, can we get the fake weights in here? Yeah, Jeff, I'm not really sure to tell you this, but uh, Coach Greg Doucette called us out for fake weights, so you have to actually lift it now. I know, it's kind of annoying. Yeah, actually, about that, my kids need to get picked up for soccer practice, so I'm gonna be right back. Ladies and gentlemen, now that I have your attention, what is going on? Jesse James West here. Hope you're ready for an amazing day. Today, we're gonna be eating and training like the one and only Athlean X, okay? Yes, he goes down in the history books, but we're gonna be determining whether he's a liar or if he's a truther. If you're new to the channel, please, please hit the subscribe button. I love you so much. Uh, we're on the road to a million and I'm trying to get there. Get us to 500K, okay? I love you. Without further ado, let's get going. So, for the first meal, I would put an apron on, but I genuinely have only clothing here, which is just weird in my opinion. I wish I had no clothing. We have an oatmeal finanza. That's what I'm gonna call it. So, we have oats, stevia brown sugar, some walnuts, and 100% pumpkin, okay? And we're also gonna be cooking up seven to 10 egg whites. So, the next step is to take one cup of runeski of the oats. Jeff Cavalier likes to microwave things, but he also likes to explain himself for a whole lot. I don't know why, he seems to be a guy that gets ripped apart on the internet sometimes. So he has to constantly explain why he does things and why he doesn't need to be ripped apart. So with that being said, Jeff, I forgive you. Syrup! He adds a little bit of sugar-free syrup in there. He adds some almond milk. We need skim milk, but I'm gonna do almond milk because I don't need dairy. We microwave this in the microwave. What else would you use? Three minotos. And now we wait. Actually, while that's going, we prepare our egg whites. He says he does about seven to 10 egg whites. He doesn't really measure his food. So with that being said, should we question his ability to stay shredded all year round? I don't know, I don't know. Is getting shredded doable without tracking your food? I'll tell you by the end of the day. And while we wait. Explode. Okay. Oh. Oh. oh my. That nearly exploded. Okay, microwaving egg whites. Kind of new to this, but I'm always down to try new things. Let's get into breakfast and I'll give you guys a full taste test. First taste test for the boys back home. Literally, we're back home. I'm not gonna lie, that pumpkin is really good. Let's try the egg white souffle. That sounds a bit too fancy to be microwaving my eggs and calling it a souffle. A little rock hard on the edges, not a problem. <laughs> Interesting texture, but gotta get our protein in for the morning. This is a lot bigger of a breakfast than I would personally have, so maybe I should implement a bigger breakfast to kind of like satiate me throughout the day. We got a cup of almond milk. We would normally do skim milk, but I don't have dairy like I said. So we're gonna dig into this, eat the whole entire thing. I'll let you guys know how I feel, and we're gonna continue the day on, and see if this dude is fibbing or if he's truthing. As a wise man once said, cheers to the governor. I'm gonna give it a little dip in the almond milk. I feel like it's gonna be pretty good. All right, let's dig in. You already know the words. Last bite, Jeff Cavalier, athletex.com. Say it for me. <laughs> Jeff Cavalier, best bite! I love shoving nuts down my throat. Walnuts, take it easy. So for that meal, we're looking at 56 grams of protein, 84 carbs, and 27 fat. Super balanced, I'm extremely full. So we'll see how that carries on to the rest of the day because we have to go get some stuff done. So we are gonna move our way on to the first workout of the day. We're gonna be doing a cardio circuit by the man himself. I have my handy dandy laptop right here with me and we're gonna do a follow along 15 minute fat burning workout. And if I'm shredded after this, then he's not a liar, but otherwise I'm gonna call him a complete liar and fraud. I'm not gonna judge him that hard. Jeff, you're a good guy. 
I hope. Actually, you didn't answer my DM, so I have no idea. Jeff, you have 48 hours to DM me back or I'm hunting your ass down. Let's get into the workout. Three, tarps off for the boys, nice and early. Hop to the side. Yes, Jeff. What is this? Why am I doing this? This makes no sense. I don't know how this is gonna build my chest or burn fat, but you do what Daddy Jeff says. Back to it, hover push-ups. More like half reps. Jeff Cavalier half reps. And we got a ad. We got an ad. Jeff, if you're gonna do a follow along, you literally cannot put ads on the video, bro. Even though an ad's going, I'm just gonna take a quick break. All right, let's skip the ad. Core. We have four exercises. I'm not gonna lie, this is not a beginner like routine at all. If there was someone that was like a complete beginner, there's no way they're doing this. Ab routine, here we go. It's double pump, I like to call it. Why do I feel like an idiot? I think I lost like three pounds of fat already, actually. V up pulses. <sighs> Jeff Cavalier, baby! I did it! I'm not gonna lie to you. It actually does feel really good. It's like a, honestly, you'd probably build a little bit of muscle if you're new to the gym doing this. I definitely recommend trying this ab routine out. Jeff, I gotta give it to you. I think you're a truther, man. I think you're a truther. We'll see what we have for the rest of the day, though. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we are gonna make a quick trip to the store. It's Mother's Day, so we're gonna go get my mom some flowers to thank her for being an amazing mother. We'll see what she says. I think she's gonna love it. She has no idea. She thinks that I'm just going out to go get some coffee to fill my addiction, but I'm gonna do both. <laughs> Playing the wrong song. I'm not a vampire, but I feel like one. Body's always aching. Seems to be my holy water. Let's go, baby. Guys, I'm dropping an album. That's it, right there. This is where you find single mom, especially on Mother's Day, because they're like, you know what? I want my own gift. Oh, this is my mom's favorite flower. Yellow. What are these? Roses? Yellow roses. These look kind of beat up, but I feel like it gets character. It's dripping. Is it? Oh, she ain't dripping. I'm not drowning. I feel like that's the best we're gonna get. All the good ones are gone. Same with all the good girls in the world. We'll find love. No, we won't. Final verdict, this is the one. Let's go. Oh, what is this? A narwhal? No, it's a Lorax. A Lorax. Where, where's my childhood? Dr. Seuss, the Lorax. I'm getting this. Happy Mother's Day, everybody. I'm insane. All right, boys. Let's go, surprise me, Madre. Happy, Happy Mother's Day, Mom. Oh, there it is. Yeah. There you go. There it is. I got you the Dr. Seuss thing, the Lorax, and then I know you like those flowers. I love you. I love you too. You're a great mother. Oh, thank you. Happy Mother's Day. Thank you. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another edition of Jesse's Kitchen. Now, I don't have my apron, okay? It's in California. So I just figured. Jesse, is that an eggplant in your pants? Are you happy to see me? It's literally an eggplant. We're gonna get to that in a second. Anyways, I don't have an apron, so I figured I would just be naked the entire time. The rest is on the OnlyFans. For today's ingredients, we're gonna be making a wrap. We're gonna have a zucchini about life size, an eggplant where girth matters, raw meat to beat, yogurt, whipped cream, and then he normally would do pesto sauce, but I don't eat dairy, so we're gonna do some light mayonnaise, all on some healthy wraps. All right, I'm just gonna Google how to unwrap an eggplant because I have no idea how to do this. Oh my God! Don't use those search terms. How to peel an eggplant. Why? People are fed up, man. Apparently you peel it. Oh, I'm a chef. I'm a chef! La Almuerzo. I definitely got that wrong. Listen, I cheated in Spanish too. We have a nice wrap. We got our yogurt on the side. I'm gonna say, this is kind of similar to a Greg Doucette recipe, okay? Is that coincidence? I don't know. Let's taste test. Mmm, okay. Wow, that is fire. Good choice of vegetables. Chicken, hot sauce, mayo. Oh my God, I can only imagine pesto. This is so good. Let's dig in. Last bite, best bite of the wrap, and then we got dessert, baby. 
I am immensely full. You guys want to lick my fingers? Okay, so we have some yogurt. I'm going to be doing some dairy-free yogurt because I don't need dairy. He has full fat yogurt, and we're going to be doing... Oh, baby, this is where it's at. Shake her up, toss her on. Oh! I'm going to use this tonight. Whipped cream maroon ski with some yogurt. Well, this guy knows how to have a good treat, I'll tell you that. Best bite, best bite! It is time to get cracked out! We got Stim Free, Code Jesse for the boys back home. Hey, if you wanna support me, links down below. Get a workout program, jessejimswest.com. It is time to get into this workout. First step is gonna be a warm up. It's a 3D dumbbell lunge. We're gonna take the dumbbells, we're gonna lunge forward, sideways, and a 45 degree angle, seven reps each one. This movement is extremely confusing, so good luck to you. What seems to be next in the program for our working sets is a pause squat. He doesn't seem to be using a belt or knee sleeves or anything, so I'm gonna do it completely raw, and raw is always better. Let's hit these squats, Jeff Cavalier, I am now your son. We have three to four sets of 10 to 12 reps of this hip thrust. You'd think after like working out with 500 fit girls that I'd be able to do this by now, but I'm still working. I definitely look like a complete bitch because there are girls that warm up with 185 like it's nothing. But that's why we're out here getting better, baby. Here we go, baby, let's go. All right, so we're moving on to some barbell bench press. Three sets of five, going to the upper body now. I'm gonna do probably one warm-up set because my body's already warm, and then we're gonna jump right into it. We are in the old dungeon. Okay, hold on. This is where practice safe sets started. Practice safe sets, baby. Let's go. We got six to eight reps, three sets, baby. Last two exercises, and we're going to be doing farmer carries, and then we got to do face pull. All right, guys, last exercise is gonna be face pulls. I found my way back home. I definitely was not over there in the bushes. Don't you dare turn it. All right, ladies and gentlemen, there it is. Jeff Cavalier's full body workout. We are now gonna go refuel, finish the day strong because we have a few more meals to eat. The game plan is we're gonna go to the mall. We're gonna pick up some shoes for Mason. I missed his 21st birthday, so we have to replenish this by getting him a nice gift. And then we'll say what's up to him and surprise him. He still has no idea. He thinks we're gonna be streaming. He'll be going on his computer to stream and I'm just gonna show up at his house. So I'm really excited. The kid's pro I'm, I'm calling that he cries. Just kidding, I have so much energy. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's commence Operation Find Mason, the sickest pair of shoes. I want to get him something that he does not have. I know for a fact he does not have these. These are so sick. Is Mason worth 80 bucks? I think this is it. This is $65. It's a Van Croc. Crocs are 35. Can I get these in a 10? I think he would like the Tigers. <laughs> this is actually for my grandfather. Yeah, he told me he wants to be more hip, so I, I bought him some vans. Isn't that pretty cool, right? All right, Grandpa Mason is gonna be very happy with this gift. Listen, if there's one thing I'm not skipping out on, it's pleasing the homies. We got the vans, we acquired the gift, we're gonna go surprise him and see what he says. It is now time that we commence the full operation of surprising Mason for his 21st birthday. My ride's here! You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. We're gonna give Mason a call, we're outside of his house right now, and he has no idea, he thinks we're about to stream. Dude, I'm ready to play. You are? Okay. Uh, are you on the Discord? Yeah, I can hop on right now. Alright, I'm turning my lab. I'm turning my computer on. Okay. I'll be there in a sec. 
Alright, see you, bro. Bye. I just said I'll be there in a sec. <laughs> Alright, let's go. I'm just gonna full send it. Mason, can you come here quick? I need you, come here. Some of <laughs> what the hell? Happy birthday, <laughs> birthday. Why are you home? <laughs> dude, I was, I was so right confused. Here. Happy birthday, I got I was... you a late birthday gift. Are you serious? Yes, dude. Dude, I literally was just sitting on there, I was like, <laughs> I, told him, <laughs> I told him to join the Discord and everything. When I was on the phone with you, I was like, yeah, I'll be there in a second. I was like, oh, oh my <laughs> god. I said that, I was like, oh. Yeah, bro, I updated my thing. <laughs> well, and then she knocked, and I was like, what's this idiot want? <laughs> I was like, what's she gonna make me do it's something? perfect, right? Yeah, that was a good one. First of all, these are actually really sick. I knew you'd like those. Dude, I always wear funky socks. I know. I got exactly. my uh, Kutsky socks on. <laughs> I hope I said that right. I, fi I figured you'd like the freaking, what are they, like a lion yeah. or a tiger or something? Oh, and then I knew Dude, this little, is little emo. Uh, yeah, but it goes with every single pair of black yeah. pants that I own with rips in the knees. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you got me so much. And this is so nice. These are the nice ex nice van shirts that are always too expensive for me to buy. Remember when we yeah. used to go? We used to go in like high school to van. We just always, we'd always just look because we're like, ah, I could find this somewhere else. Yeah, we'd, go to, we'd so want to go to Marshall's and yeah, get it somewhere else. Exactly. Oh my god, bro, these are so sick. Right? Aren't these they are sick? so sick. I, fig I figured you don't have high tops. Dude, these are so sick. This, yeah. These are like a cool color, right? You see, I'd buy my, I'd buy my girlfriend something, but I don't have that, so I just I fulfill it through Mason. Oh, Those bro. are fresh, bro. Sick. Those look sick. Oh my god! I Dude, figured like he's so a power lifter and he's gonna want to like. Wear those with his weird socks while doing some like bench press, so that's exactly why I did that. Like a squishy sole and everything. These are fresh. Bro. Dude, thank you so much. Of course, man. So love you, bro. I think I'd be all this. Love you too, man. Dude, are you it's your 21st minutes? birthday, bro. Yeah. Dude, this is awesome. Thank you so much. So, we are moving our way on to the next meal. We have a good array of food. We have some corn, chicken, pasta, Sweet potato, some tomato soup. So we're gonna put all this together, make this amazing dish. For the tomato orzo soup, we're gonna be replacing orzo with just plain rice. It's pretty much the same macros. Toss some tomato soup in there, and then you add a little water. All right, now I'm gonna heat this up and then get working on everything else. The next step, Arunski, is gonna be to mash your sweet potato. Now listen, I'm not just saying it because it's me, but if there's any single moms out there that need me to cook for the kids on the weekends and take a little break from themselves, I can do it. Now th there is something missing. Cue the music! All right, boys, let's dig in. All right, me amigos, last bite, best bite. Up next, we're replacing a protein shake that Athlinex would normally have with a wonderful Built Bar. Now these are amazing, high in protein, taste like candy. That, I, I, that's mine, I paid for it. Wait, what? Mine, I paid for it. Where did you get that? BuiltBar.com. Wait, 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 did you at least use my code? Of course. Jesse James West 10. Oh, make sure you guys use my code, I really appreciate it. Get yourself some Built Bar. It's a great way to replace a protein shake and refuel, baby. He doesn't know I know where the stash is. Hey, what are you doing back there? Get away from that Built Bar. Just got some syrup. For the very last meal of today, it's gonna be a dessert. I chose some Halo Top because it is dairy free. A little bit of more whipped cream. This guy's obsessed with whipped cream. Jeff Cavalier's a little kinky, I say. Let's dig in, boys. Stay with me, last bite, best bite. Ending the night there. All right, everybody, we have officially completed the Athlean full day of eating and training like him. We're ending the day at 195 protein, 361 carb, and 78 fat. A little bit higher on the calorie side than I would normally do. I feel full, I feel satiated, and the training was pretty good. I'd probably just add a lot more volume. I definitely recommend checking his stuff out. It's very informational 
Now he has been a part of some like fake weights and lying to people, but in my opinion, I think the content's pretty solid and at least he's inspiring others to better themselves like I'm trying to do every day. So if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, turn on post notifications and drop a like for the boys and the girls. There are 7% of you out there. I love you all. Don't forget to stay relentless. Peace.